Started from a DM, now she wanna see him. If you wanna link, baby, gotta be the weekend. Just follow me. Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel and welcome to part 4 of my Realm of Magic LP, Moon Lovers. And here we are, once again, in the Realm of Magic. I just cannot stay away. But this time we're here with Heijin and she's getting a little fishing on in the garden while the boys are at home. Which is uh, opposite of what we've been doing um, the last couple of parts where the boys have been here because at the end of the last part if you have not seen it please go ahead and check it out Miss Lovely Haitian became a spellcaster so here we are enjoying she's kind of been stuck at home in glimmer book because it was a blizzard like she got home by the time she got to the back to home to glimmer book the boys were already inside the house so she just went to bed and then like by the time the boys went to bed a blizzard took over so they were all kind of stuck in the house which was fine because they kind of slept late into the evening <laughs> so they got up in time for Hagen to make dinner and she cleaned up the house and kind of snuck up was trying to sneak away back to the house but then the snow let up so she walked to the realm of magic i know she has a glimmer stone which i completely forgot but you can only like use it once oh she got a lot of stuff on her inventory already but it's all right we're gonna start using some of this stuff and she got a whim to get a big catch and i was like you can't fish in limmerbrook at the current moment so i'm gonna let her come here and just see if she can catch any fish at this lovely spot here in the garden since that's all we can really do i wonder if any of the vegetation um sprouted yet lord the snake is just a busy um apple tree there's still nothing on it but I guess it's only been a day. Oh, she leveled up in fishing though, but can you catch something though? That would be lovely. And I think I want to bring the boys here as well, but I don't want them to go, like, come here, here. <laughs> I want them to come to the realm of magic. Ooh, and let's zoom out anyway, because I haven't completely, like, zoomed out to show you guys exactly how the realm of magic works. Like, you kind of come here and it all the portals take you to the different islands uh can i let's see can you bring him here go here i don't know see i feel like he's probably he <laughs> probably came in dang she didn't catch anything okay you sir come here and since you kind of need to be using, where is the, oh, someone's on it. Okay, never mind, they're getting off. Uh, experiment, go ahead. I probably kind of actually want you to duel as well. I need to have you take off your cold weather wear. Um, we'll bring yourself here as well. And then I need for you, sir, to, where is practical magic area? Um, let's, I still want you to kind of, you'd prefer to read anyway. Um, search for tomes over here and Miss Hazen you couldn't catch no fish you wanted to catch a fish uh go fishing try again I just want to complete your win why are you this oh right I keep forgetting right I just said it I need to take off your um hot weather wear your cold weather wear can't speak change your off I know I'm sorry I'm sorry let's put that on the cute dress that we got with Roman magic and then you can go back to fishing thank you you don't know the boys are here the boys don't know you are here you are probably gonna get hot as well so up and out of these clothes please and thank y'all so I appreciate you and then go back to experimenting I think what came in is everyday wear so he's good so that's the thing about traveling to the realm of magic um, when it's winter. And I still have not put in that mod I was supposed to. As I'm here, I'm remembering that I should put that mod in to get rid of some random spellcasters. But it's all right. Are you finding anything, sir? Let me see. What do you want to do? <clears throat> oh, you want to stargaze with your but Y'all can do that here. Oh, you're still searching. Okay. Let me see if you find anything out, sir, please. You gonna catch anything? <gasps> Ooh, 
Ooh, you caught a cow plant berry. Does that count? Nope, I guess not. <laughs> it was caught. It was something. Jeez. Come on. Please catch something. Anybody, find out something. <laughs> Can we get some new information, please? I feel like we need to pop. Ooh. I forgot. We got talent points we need to use. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay. What is this now? Uh, power shun. Casting a spell now adds significantly less spec caster charge. I feel like we haven't done enough of that. I've had my sims do a lot of, like, learning the skill. I think we need to start putting it into action. Uh, let's see what else. Uh, what else we got here? Incredible Forge, Experimenter, Insightful Eye, and what else? Spe Spellcaster, Socialite. Okay, no. Um, <laughs> research, experiment, and experiment and tone reading spe speeds are greatly increased. Um, this sim now receives more items when harvesting magical ingredients in the magic realm. Uh, when experimenting and practicing sims gain experience faster with less failures. Oh, I kind of like that idea. I'll do the experimenter because he's definitely doing that a lot. Um, mm, potion crafting, knowledge is magic, Sims can read. Eh. Right, I'm not trying to take him down that path. I'm trying to be, stick straight with this. So, yeah, let me not use all of them for now. We got two of them down, so that works fine. Does Wook have a need to get rid of? No. And Miss Hajin is still a baby, so she's still a apprentice. <laughs> but we, so we need to get her to hurry up and catch a fish, so we can start working on her spell casting skill as well. But I think before she gets a chance to do that, she'll definitely be caught by the boys, cause girl is just chilling here in the realm of magic like it's nothing. But since they all slept late, they got plenty of energy, so I think they're all gonna be here for quite a while. <sighs> I thought you were gonna be better at this. <laughs> you are, sweetie. Because <laughs> you're not. Ca I mean, you caught a cow plant berry. That is no small feat. Because I've had a black world that I could not get to find a cow plant berry the second time for a life. But anyway, that's no here, no there. Um. Oh, I wonder. Yeah, oh no, we're not at the level to use bait. What level is that? I think you have to be higher up than level two that we are. Oh, finally! You caught a fish! Yay! What'd you catch? What is it? An angel fish! Okay. Excellent quality. Okay, we are done. You are feeling super confident. So let's head back to HQ and see if we can get some training going. Um, return to HQ. I mean, we might as well try to find the sage that we talked to. Why are you stressed, bruh? Who's around you? I mean, it's just Morgan. Oh, no, there's extra people around. My bad. I'm sorry. You practicing. Okay, you are here at HQ. Um, let's go have a tinkle first before we go find our practical magic stage that actually um, changed us. Uh, bathroom? Bathroom? Where's the bathroom? I thought... I swear there was a bathroom on this floor. Or maybe I was wrong. I swear there was. Oh, here it is. There you go. <laughs> Be like a champion. Ooh, there's a duel going on. Okay, okay. Somebody do something. Okay, there we go. Ooh, ooh. Isn't that, who? one of the brothers had a duel with him. Was it Wook, I believe, and he lost? Yeah, embarrassing, I know. It's all right. I'm going to get him back. I'm going to have one of my sims do him, and we're going to get him back. Who knows? It might even be Haitian. It would be lovely if it would be her, though. But I think what should have been himself as well, though. Okay. I th right. It's like she walked past one of them just now. <laughs> uh, Wook is going to be like, um, was that who I thought it was? <laughs> like, nah, that's not it. He's gonna be respectful. Wait, is that still um so? 
There's still servings of his mac and cheese. No one's gonna come and eat it. I'm hating. Yeah, you can't hide out, ma'am. Um, hold on. Uh, ooh, how should I do this? Like, uh, ask about day. Like, uh, so how you doing? <laughs> How'd you get here? <laughs> What's going on? Oh, look at the hug. That's cute. I don't feel like he's gonna be as upset that she's officially a spellcaster. I mean, and compliments her outfit. Um, have a deep conversation with her, and then let's see if I can have her just go ahead and tell him an unbelievable story. Oh, she's getting hungry. We got plenty of mac and cheese behind you, sweetie. Plenty. Um, let's see, what do you want to do? Oh, you want to cloud gaze? Well, y'all just love to be out and just cloud gaze and stuff like that. Missy is Wook hungry as well? Kind of is. So, low key, y'all could just grab a serving together and have a chat. Um, let's go ahead and just add her to your group. And let's... Uh, okay, hello. I was like, I can't get to the cauldron. Oh. Well, grab a serving then by yourselves. I was trying to be quick about it, but since I can't do it like that, go ahead and grab a serving, eat both of you. Make sure y'all eat it all up. All right, there we go. And just have another chat. Uh, share my some ideas with him. Like, you know, why don't you train me? Get to know him a little bit more. And tell him an engaging story. Oh, look at them. Just Where is So, though, by the way? Because he is still pressed. Oh, he needs to go tinker. Oh, Lord. What did you do? Because that was just negative reputation. Like, you're going to have, like, the worst reputation if you keep this up, sir. Oh, and there he goes. He walks right past the situation. Like I said, I didn't think it was going to be long before she got caught. But, honestly, once she head back to HQ, it was kind of done and over with. <laughs> she was going to get caught. But like he, she's giving him the whole rundown of how she eventually turned into a spellcaster. Look at her. Go ahead. She's feeling herself. Well, um, brighten her day. And let <laughs> uh, enthuse about Mel. So is like so rude. You got food right here. Come and grab a serving. Come and grab a serving. Oh, look at that. What got a good reputation and worked on some charisma. Oh, they're good friends. Oh, y'all so cute. Like, you made this, sir. And he's just going to be like, so we just hanging out here? <laughs> uh, let's start off with a um, lie about career. And let's do some more mischief. Uh... And still false confidence in her. I know you really don't like talking to her, but yeah. Thank you, sir. Because <laughs> honestly, the day I played off screen was ridiculous. Because he was like, anytime she would walk into the room, he would walk out. I was like, bruh, do you dislike her that much? Like, your red bar is not even that high. Um, and then you're just going to be just flat out mean. You're going to rile her up and get your little two cents in. What a lovely conversation you're having with your bosses. <laughs> okay. Look at him just being fresh. And what do you want to do with your brother, though? Oh, you want to be mischievous with your brother as well. So, okay. Oh, no, not me. Not me. Not me. <laughs> mischief. Um, scare him, I guess. I don't know. Uh oh, you getting a neck? Yep, yeah, you're ruining your. <laughs> she cut the conversation. She like, I'm not even impressed about you. Um, I wonder, can Wook even do anything though? Compliments his outfit. Did you? Were you mischievous to your brother like I told you to? I almost clicked bow pickup line so quickly. I need to reel it in. Uh, oh no, he still hasn't done it yet. I'm like, it'd be nice if you can do that. Cause I kind of want her to go ask him for some training. Ooh, I didn't mean to. 
I like how it still look good though, but I mean we're in the realm of magic, even though it's been like a day and it should have spoiled. But at least it's here for my sims to eat. Um let's see. Magic. Um magic duel. Do a friendly duel. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh, but what kind of liked it though? Oh, um, ma'am, off the phone. I was trying to ask for a whole duel situation. Like, <laughs> so just keeps interrupting. Um, magic duel, friendly duel, please and thank you. Uh, you, sir, you are kind of tired now. And I think you're not really feeling all the people around. So I think you're going to kind of head home. But these two are going to have a little fun. Because Wook is a nice person and not going to treat her meanly just because she's in the realm of magic. Oh, it's kind of, oh, it's like, I write. And they did say that the realm of magic has its own day and night cycle. It's definitely brighter outside. Okay, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, okay. That was harsh. Oh, you need to tinkle, sir. Be nice. She's new at it. <laughs> but look at her face, though. She is, look, so concentrating so hard. Ooh. Oh, my girl, you okay? It's all right. You learned some stuff. Okay, you, sir, go tinkle, please, before you have an accident. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Right, girl. Uh, right, you need a nap after that. Oh, okay. Oh, she got riled up. Wow. <laughs> but she's so confident about everything else. She's not too pressed about being riled up by so. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> You go take a quick nap. I'm going to let him go to the bathroom because I actually want Wolf to take you to Castor Alley so that you can get some supplies because, sis, you going to need it. I still want to put a cauldron, but the calendar when we were in Glimmerbrook showed that we were having another blizzard coming up soon. <laughs> so, um, I don't have the space to put the cauldron. I could put it on that top, top level that I haven't placed anything on. But that requires we work in the kitchen, even though we have lovely configurable stairs. I am not the best builder. So trying to figure out how to work the stairs without having to rearrange upstairs too much is not a good look. So I kind of wanted to put the cauldron outside. And it's not having the best weather for it. Are you done, sir? You are done. Before you go take a nap, though, I know you all want to sleep. Let's go take her to go. Where did she go? Where is she? Right here. Um, come and wake her up real quick and let's head off to Caster's Alley and see if we can, um, cause I, which portal is it? Um, hold on. <laughs> cause I went through, uh, let's see, which one is, this one is to, oh, perfect. Go to Caster's Alley, wake her up and go to Caster's Alley, both of you. And let's see what we can get there. Hopefully some shops will be open. Well, it's like 11 something in the morning. So they should be open, right? And come on, missus. Let's follow through. I wish I could say go to Caster's Alley together, but I guess that's a new. Uh, let's head over to Caster Alley as well, ma'am, please. And thank you. Let's hurry this up. Cause luckily we don't have to, luckily we don't have to go through loading screen i've been stumbling over my word this entire part okay hey jim where you at sweetie still coming okay so i said well please do not oh i completely forgot to pay bill so we definitely need to head back to glimmerbrook uh let's see no uh i need to buy her a wand Wands, tomes, and familiars. There we go. Yes. Let's go. But technically, I want Wook to buy it for her. No, no, no. Stop. He at least going to buy her wand. Um, buy wands and tomes. Oh, I'm still on her. I swore it got on him. Um, I want her to buy a familiar, of course. Ooh. 
Um. Ooh, I kind of want the fairy. Not and not just because it's a hundred dollars, <laughs> hundred simoleons, but I do want the fairy. And and let's get a a tome. And Wilk told you he would buy you your wand. So he's going to go and buy a wand for you. And then I'm going to send you guys home. I know you're exhausted. I'm sorry you've been out all <laughs> night. And technically into the next day. Miss, come over here and choose it. You can't go to sleep. And let's see. Um... Uh... I feel like, I'm trying to remember, no, the one that Wook has is not here. Okay, and I, I kind of want them all to have a different one, even though So technically doesn't use his. Um, He's going to buy her a natural. He's going to, like, he's like, I'll buy you the marble wand when you, like, really get better at this. So he's got her the natural wand, and it works for her being an alchemy, I feel, as well. And then I want you, sir, hopefully he can gift it as well. <laughs> because this would be embarrassing. Um, granted, I could just put her in inventory. Uh, give gift. A friendly gift. And natural wand. There we go. Oh, I know, and you're tired. I know, bro. I feel you. It, it's been a long day. But you should be feeling focused, more focused about winning the duel against. Oh, this is. Oh. I'm trying to find the perfect angle for a good little screenshot. I need my memories. Okay, there we go. Oh, where they at? Where they at? Where they at? Okay, there we go. Hopefully she will like it because I went through all of this excitement for her to not like it. <laughs> I think she liked it. Oh, so cute. Uh, give him a heartfelt compliment. And a friendly, um, brighten his day. There we go. And then I'm going to send you guys off to home because you're both tired. <laughs> Let's see, what do you else do you want to do? Enthuse about outdoors, and you still want to cloud gaze with him. But I'm going to let these guys head off home and go to sleep, and I'll meet you guys when they're up and energized. Oh, look at that in the back. Oh, that is Caster's Alley. Oh, that looks so cool. <laughs> I'll meet you guys tomorrow, or later on. All right, guys, so it's actually really not much that much later i can't speak but the everybody kind of went to sleep and morgan asked so if he could come over and hang out and he's super flirty and the funny thing is he had a thought bubble of hagen when he got here and i'm like and he's flirty so you really didn't come over here to hang out with so you came over here to to get to know of the new spellcaster that's been hanging out in the realm and you are hella flirty about it um that's rude just using somebody I mean, so is not probably going to figure it out right away. Not that he really cares that anything special for Hagen, but he doesn't like being used to get to talk to her. Oh, when you guys are wearing similar jackets, um, talk about snow. I think he probably wants to, you know, let's see if we can do, uh, let's be a little mischief with him. Uh, let's instill some false confidence in him. Right. Uh, hold on. Wait a minute. I was talking to you, bruh. We were having a whole conversation. Like, you don't just up and walk into my house. And so far, con false confidence, I can speak. And I low-key want you guys to do it. I mean, even if it's just for some information. Or well, we could do a heated one. But, you know, Morgan is a sage. I don't know if that's the best bet for, <laughs> um... Uh, give fake bad news. I don't know if that's the best bet for so at the current moment. He may be gaining skill fast, but I don't know if trying to have a heated duel with a sage is the best look for him. But I mean, magic duel. Let's see. Let's duel for knowledge. And then if it doesn't work out, then we can do the heated duel because then he will probably be mad. Because, I mean, the last time he lost the duel, he was quite upset. And he'll think it was against Morgan, too. 
I mean, if y'all want to, you know, get up and go outside, you might be able to do that. Um, actions, add to group, or can we only duel in the realm of magic? That's another thing I don't know. I hope they can duel here because that will be slightly embarrassing that I went through all of this. Um, let's go here together. And hopefully that we can do this. So it works really well for my storyline that I got going on. Oh, my choices. Magic. Magic duel. Duel for knowledge. I mean, because, I mean, they can practice magic here. So they should be able to duel here. Right? I know it's heavy snow right now, but that doesn't mean y'all can't duel. Okay. There we go. Okay. Just because y'all were sitting and wouldn't move. Okay. All right. We getting a duel in the snow. Get it. Get it. Oh. Ooh. Come on, so You can do it. Get it. Get it. Ooh. Come on. I wonder if he's going to one day just naturally pull out his wand. I just want, I prefer him to use his hand. So I don't want him to direct, to like pick, to, uh, I can't get the words out. Oh no. Oh. And I was just trying to get some knowledge. He is a little riled up. Hold on. That is a lovely screenshot. Why you look so cute? I mean... Ooh, can we? <laughs> it's like, can we back up a little bit? That is a gorgeous screenshot. Yes. Okay, back up. Sorry. We're not done with you, Morgan. <laughs> I need a heated duel. A magic duel. Heated duel. Let's do this. And he was going to walk away to go shovel. No, sir. It's not the snowfall. Let's go. <laughs> go. Let's do a heated duel. And see what this does. Oh, we got a little. Uh, uh huh, uh huh. You didn't get as mad this time. Let's see how a heated duel looks. Ooh, come on, so you can do it, please, please. Oh, Mister Sage is here. Oh, you got him. I mean, hey, you want to give me some training? Oh. Oh, come on. I know it's a long shot, but we can still try, right? No! No! <gasps> I'm so sorry. Ugh. Oh, but you still got some action to leave. And let's actually go introduce... No, 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 don't walk away. Don't walk away from me. <laughs> okay, calm down. Let's do... A funny introduction to her like <laughs> that was funny back there I wasn't really putting my all into it asking to leave wait who's sparking was that him or Morgan I think it's Morgan because I don't hear it anymore oh so he really put his all into it and he's like yeah <laughs> that was not me all right come on right come on hello Thank you. Um, get to know. Uh, give her a heartfelt compliment. I mean, we could use some training. Always here for the training. Talk about freezing temperatures. And uh, friendly. Ask her career. You can definitely tell that she's one of the higher up sages. Uh. Talk about best bait, and let's ask her for some magic information. Magic. No. Spells. Let's see. Oh, wait, no. Ask, ask for magical training. Oh, she's an, an, an ooh, She is an unemployed sage. I can't speak. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Okay. Ooh, about to get some training. He's doing all of this in the snow, which I love at the same time. Okay, go ahead, sir. Right. And he's doing all of this while Agent and Wook are sleeping it away. 
So it looks like he doesn't completely hate Kaijin, or at least he's def making it seem like it's more about him. Granted, he was being used, so I mean, not getting used is also a good reason to act. But he could have just let um, Morgan get to talk to Heijin on his own, but he didn't let that happen. Hmm. Okay, thank you. What is your name again? La Faba. El Faba. Got it. Ooh. I hear you have been building your mag- Oh, right, I forgot to check the mail. I hear you've been building your magical prowess. Would you like to, to put it to the test to a du- <gasps> we're, we're invited to a duel? I'm getting some training, but I'll go. All right, guys, so here we are in the magic realm, and it looks like we're finally gonna get a duel somewhere. Oh, no, we weren't gonna go there. Where are we going to, ma'am, for this duel? I know you said the dueling grounds, but the last time I tried to do that, we didn't actually go to the dueling grounds. So where are we heading to? He's still a little angry from losing his duel from uh, with Morgan. Agony and defeat. Being defeated in a magical duel is one of the most frustrating things for any spell captor. Keep practicing to... And I lost it. I was trying to read it faster before it went away. Oh, are we actually heading to the dueling grounds? Okay, I was about to say, bro, why are you still frowning? <laughs> I thought we were just going to duel right there. But okay, we are literally heading all the way to the dueling ground. It would have been nice if we just loaded into the um, <laughs> dueling ground. Right, because I was about to say, are you about to walk through? Okay, let's see how we do. Come on. I've been rooting for you all day, girl. boy. Let's get, I was about to say, girl. <laughs> let's do this, so come on. You've been dueling and dueling. Come on, we got to get this in. But I feel bad for him to be dueling an older lady. And if he, if that's what it takes for him to win. Oh! And it, it was nothing for me to worry about because he definitely didn't win that. Oh! <gasps> Suwon got the no. That is so rude. Suwon got the curse of unwarned hostility from losing too many duels. That is so rude. Ah, <laughs> oh, my goodness. What does what does that mean though? For some reason, everyone just wants to be mean to you and even start fight with you. Oh no. <laughs> Oh, this is going to be a tough one for him. Ugh. And he was doing so well. I mean, he kind of started the whole succession down, though. But it's all right. He shouldn't have tried to take on the stage. But, guys, I am going to go ahead off and end this lovely, exciting part of Moon Lovers right here, guys. If you did enjoy this part, please go ahead and leave it. Oh, please go tinkle. If you did enjoy this part, please go ahead and leave your comments and suggestions down below. Oh, you can go find the sink for that to have a good water, but not to tinkle. Go to the bathroom, please. <laughs> like I said, guys, if you enjoyed this part of my <laughs> Realm of Magic LP, please go ahead and leave your comments and suggestions down below. Hit that like button because you know you want to. Subscribe if you haven't. And hit that bell button so you get notified every time I upload a video. And until next time, guys, bye. I can't believe he's cursed. <laughs>